Yeah. So, rumor has it, <laughs> my little van gets a little treat today. Yeah, we're gonna bolt one of our new ladders on of it, which yeah, is pretty cool. cool. Um, we're not gonna do steal one of them because Rui's packed them already and he'll get crouchy. There is one right there. Is oh. there? Yeah. What, unpacked one? Yeah, there's one unpacked one there. Is this the unpacked one? Yep. Hell yeah. These are pretty rare actually. Should we take it to the workbench? If you're like a packer and shipper boy, yeah. best knife in the game, bread knife. The old bread knife. A why? quiver of them. Oh, why bread knife over the old Stanley? Just a bit, I, more traction. Yeah, nice. I'm a four wheel drive boy. I like it. Off-roader. Just like, yeah, just go better. That's Makes noises. Whoa. Should we put it over here and then you can do like slow mos in and out of it. Just like uber sexy with that, that Mark Spencer flute with Mac track. Where, what, what's it made from? This is a mild steel with a friggin' hectic amount of powder coat on it because we didn't want them to, as you can imagine, get rusty. But we were, um, we liked, we wanted the, the frame itself to be a bit daintier than like, days like, I'm a massive tradey fan, fan. But um, yeah, we just wanted to like take a teeny bit of weight and just crudeness out of it, but also keep it kind of still like in a bit tradey, which is why we use box section. And then the bit we worked really hard on was the lines for it to follow the tailgate on uh, the tailgate and also the barn door. So this works on a tailgate T5 and a barn door T5 and a T6 and tailgate T6. And then we pissed around pretty, took quite a lot of time to get this right. Um, but yeah, we didn't want to go like crazy elaborate. We wanted it to be a sort of crude, but Cool. Yeah, and it's, it's a ladder. So it's it a, ladder. To be a ladder. And um, it just freak. It's one of those things. You're like, do I need a ladder? You know, like, don't need a ladder. But then when you have a ladder, you need a ladder. You need a ladder. You just yeah. You unleash the Potential. balcony yeah. of life. And then yeah, that puppy sits about there. And then we've used, we've made it work with the strongest points on the doors. So it's yeah, and to this, you know. This line, this line, uh, yeah. And Rue is gonna point me in the direction of the screw packs and the neoprene doodahs. I'm so sorry. No, you don't be sorry. You, what were you listening to? Uh, Dance Machine. Of course. <laughs> Here is a what's in the box kind of deal. This big boy goes on the big boy over there. You sure it's a van? And these are to stop thing in your van, eh? Yeah, we do. I mean, we're about to harm the paintwork anyway, because we're about to drill some bloody big holes in it. But that, you know, we okay. don't. Yeah. It helps. Yeah, sure thing. But yeah, you want to. This is a. These are neoprene. It's more of a um, to stop water getting oh, in nice. there. So when you pull it in, it's sort of. And then yeah, we've just got some zinc plated hardware here, and a cute little bag that Lovely I've bag. made a mess of. How hard is it to get in the bag, Oliver? ER, simple. And then that goes through the van, and then on the other side, and then bolt. Nice. And now she'll go and ask Joshua kindly. See if he's ready. Should we do it? It can be a bit grumpy sometimes on a Monday morning. Do you reckon you heard that? <laughs> That's Joshua. He's good at drilling holes in vans. He is. And he hates, and he hates, and he hates doing emails. <laughs> so what do we do? We say, come drill bless emails and come drill some holes in this van for us. Okay. Hey. <laughs> Let's go. This, oh, what are we looking at? <laughs> we're looking at this. This doesn't have anywhere specific to, you know, you can get a bit creative with fit, but ultimately you want it about there. Somewhere around there. Yeah. Try and obviously not block as much of a number plate as oh, you yeah. can. Oh yeah, think about that. 
because you might get in trouble with the gendarme. Bon gendarme. Gendarmerie. We're not quite sure. We haven't done the the. You're about to be the test pilot. <laughs> Bring on those fines. Yeah. It'll be fine. That five is a six now. <laughs> <laughs> and we put, mock this thing up. What happens next? Uh, I mean, it's up to you whether you go full bandit and just drill straight through it. Or the, like, the good thing to do is probably mark your holes. So Take the ladder off. Drill some holes. What you're getting here is, it's not that scary. Well, the, the, the concept of drilling holes in your van is scary, but it actually, the theory is, just drill some holes in your van. It's just a van. It's just a van. Ooh. Do you like that noise, Jim? Is that a mouse? <laughs> oh, sure, man. We're drawing on your van. Oh, come yeah, on, man. with where that is? Yeah, that well, is I've got no choice van. now, have I? <laughs> I've got no choice. So you've got to take these panels off to get to the... Um, or is it just the one panel, actually? No, on the, to be fair, we're actually shooting a bit from the hip because the first barn door one that we've had, our sample ladders weren't this long, but we figured long ladders were cooler. Yeah. So here we are today, having a bit of a shit fight, but we're just praying that when we open this, the gubbins for your lock aren't they're on now it's going to be a monday or is it going to be a monday it's going to be a tuesday let's hope it's tuesday hello oh whoa how we look it how we look it could go full martin it might be okay it might be a tuesday <laughs> What size drill bit is this? This is going to be a little pilot hole, boy. Okay. Through skin one. Now into skin two. That's fun. Regardless of your van being a barn door or a tailgate, yeah. there are two skins. Not four. Sorry. <laughs> Drilling the first hole on the outside is all good. Don't sweat. You know, you've marked it. But when you are about to go through the second hole on the other side, yeah. rather than if you, if you kept your drill at that angle, the steel, the inner steel, you probably glance it and your drill would try and piss off up. Imagine this is the inner bit of steel here. Your, your drill would probably glance it and try and do that. Okay. But what we're actually trying to do is trying to do that to actually hit it. Uh, steeper rank. Uh, yeah, angle. so okay. what I'm getting at is if you go in there as you just did, we're in now. If I kept drilling at that angle, it would glance the steel, the inner steel, and would piss off up the hill. But actually, a bit of angle gets you in. Is going to be your friend here. Okay, cool. And you, you don't, don't sweat about making this hole bigger, because it will do that. But don't from yeah, the edge. bigger anyway. <laughs> Find the sweet spot. You want to do this in one take because you just do. <laughs> oh boy, there it is, just like that. <laughs> so now you've done it with the tiny little pilot hole, boy. With the big boy. You can press banana on the big boy. You need to tell me what sizes. Size they are M10 bolts, I believe. So you want a 10 or a 10 and a half drill bit. Maybe a 10 and a half, 11. 10 and a half, 11 drill I just used a 5 then, it's really good. 5 for pilot, okay. 10 and 5. So we've just done the 10s. Done 10s. This one can now chill, he's cool. This guy here can chill, he's cool. These boys up here need a bit more um, room to party. So we'll just bore them out to what size, Joshua? Mm, big enough for your socket. So 20 mil. Maybe. 20 mil. The, the key here is to like to make sure that the pointy bit is okay. going, going out of the holes oh. rather than breaking a new hole. <laughs> 
We're coming out. Hey. Ow, that sag is really hot. <laughs> do you want to do we seal the steel with like bunny tail and yeah. Bit of a, you guys on YouTube will love that. Uh, this is primer. Nice. So this is going to stop your van going rusty now that we've drilled holes in it. Rusty air. Not matters on Rust Nexus, but Rusty air. Yeah. Look at out. this. Yeah. That needs sorting out. Oh, that smells amazing. It smells oh, so good. Great. Oh, you all right? Oh, you all right? Oh, you all right? Oh, you all right? That's how he enters. Oh, you all right? I've got something to do. I've got time to chit chat. Double busy. Yeah, in it. Let's go. <laughs> What goes in first? The bolt. Bolt. Yeah. yeah. Bolt. Go straight through. in like that. Because it's hilarious. You drive past. Like, I'm not sure. Done anything. <laughs> yeah, no, it's still like no. fully um, Bit of a fiddly one. Bit um, on a barn door, then it's. Yeah, need a nose pliers. Get the bolt lined up on that side, and then have one of your bods screwing from this side, and eventually, after you drop two or three, you'll probably get it. Oh, we on? Like, boy. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Sweet, man. That's on. Done. Give it a little, little wiggle test. I'll oh, cheers for the help. You're welcome. That was not the right time to wiggle. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> cool, man. Yeah, well, that, that seems relatively easy. Oh, don't, don't forget three, three, yeah. Three, yeah? Essentially, it's four. Okay, cool. So let's just let's just go from the top. So in the bag, what'd you get? You in the get box. A ladder. Yeah. Some foam. Yeah. Four bolts. Yeah. Four washers. Four nuts. Okay, cool. That's your lot. What size drill bits do we need? You need, ideally, a cone cutter for the big back holes. Yeah. Uh, you haven't got a cone cutter. This is what one looks like. You can find them all over the place. But I've always found the middle of little. <laughs> the middle out of little. Gives you the best quality the cone aisle. cutters. Yeah. Um, five mil to do the pile of holes. Ten, ten eight, ten, eight, the bolts are eight. So between nine and ten. Yeah. Ten if you're gonna give yourself a little bit of wiggle room. And then you need one of these boys to come in from the back. 20, mm. 20 mil. 20 mil. Nice, and then that's it. And then probably a friend to help you. Yeah. For the tricky bits of You can do bolts. it on your own, but it's, it's easier to have something. And that's what I was actually going to say. We are about, we're pretty excited to probably, hopefully, I always say this, when this video goes live, we'll have to <laughs> it. that. But um, <laughs> we're going to launch the custom house, which will see us guys finally offering, um, yeah, morning rail fitting, wheel fitting, Ladders. sort of ladder fitting, conversion fitting, and just like all of the bits that you could easily fit yourself. We'll be helping you out if you don't want to or don't feel comfortable doing it. Whoa, look at that. Look at that suspension. <laughs> that is great. And now, look at this. And we're gonna just visit and visit. Hanging out on the roof. Oh, dreamy, I wanna- Boys, girls. Yeah, nice man, I like it. Cheers, boy.